Hey guys today let me show you the secret way to move your goalkeeper to stop some goals on FIFA 23, you will be surprised how powerful it is, so let's jump into the video. We all know the different ways to move the goalkeeper, and the old one was just holding the triangle button, you hold it and the goalkeeper runs straight away from the goal towards the ball, and hope everyone knows this. Then the second way is the use of R3, where you push in the right analog, after then at the same point you move it, your goalkeeper will be moved, he moves according to the way you're moving the right stick analog after pushing it inside, and he can move anywhere you want, and a lot of the times we use it to anticipate the goal post our opponent is likely to target. But what if there's another way to move your goalkeeper very effective? You can move your goalkeeper by pressing the triangle button twice, you press it, and again the second time you hold it, your goalkeeper moves automatically to a certain direction according to the situations. The first situation is one on one, so like here you're seeing, see how the goalkeeper is positioning himself to mark the far post, and when you turn to the other side, still he marks the far post, a lot of players tend to shot to the far post, and so the goalkeeper also position himself to that post. I think this trick is so fast than using the right stick analog, when you're trying to anticipate the far post angle, just double press the triangle button and you will save a lot of goals. So it's not a guarantee that you will not concede, some good opponents will begin to notice that you're moving your goalkeeper, and they attempt the near post, so mix it up, sometimes move him, sometimes don't but I personally move him every time. The second situation is to save the cross. If you ever face the opponent who likes to spam the cross button, or if you notice the opponent's player free running into the space, there's a possibility of the opponent crossing to him, so double press the triangle button, the goalkeeper runs out of the goal in this fashion. Don't hold the triangle too much. If press the triangle, and the second time you hold it for too long, your goalkeeper reach a point and stop moving, so don't make this mistake, press it, and hold it for a few seconds and release it, such that if the opponent attempts to shoot, it's easier for the goalkeeper to run back and save it, so that was a simple tutorial, thanks for watching.